What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Ace Attorney with an Actual Lawyer. Once again, I'm your host, Zach, joined by our actual voice actor, Wes. Hey, I'm an actual voice actor. It's me, Wes. Hey. And our actual lawyer, Pridge. I'm, try I'm trying the Phoenix Wright white shirt, red tie combo. <laughs> How, how do you feel? Do you feel powerful? I feel incompetent. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. Oh boy. We, learned, we had basically run, we had basically already won the case, but now the judge is forcing us to find who's actually guilty. Right. Thing that's not my job. <laughs> right. So yeah, we we've transitioned from uh, being a a defense attorney to now actually being a private investigator. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that was a close one, huh, Mia? Really? Too bad. I'm sorry I missed it. Uh, Maya! So, what happened? Well, I think I got a pretty good idea who did it. Now all I need is a motive. And proof. Wow! Good going, Nick. Under the initial trial system, tomorrow is the last day we have. Initial trial? What's that? That's the new court system that they introduced two or three years ago. It only exists in this game. <laughs> <laughs> they had so many cases in the system, they decided to speed the whole process up. So under that system, trials have to end in three days? I'm kind of surprised if you exist in this universe, you wouldn't know this, Maya. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I mean, hey, she, was like entire... she was 15 when they implemented it, basically. That's true. That's it's true. almost like this entire conversation is just for exposition. <laughs> well, enough of exposition. We've got no time to waste. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back to the studio. <laughs> uh, hello, it's me again. <laughs> Remember that bit when I wasn't talking? I'm still not doing it. <laughs> the old windbag sure is quiet today. <laughs> you know, this place is really peaceful like this. <laughs> Nick, I think her guard's down. That's a good that's good wordplay, Maya. That's good wordplay. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. I bet we could even eat those donuts if the guards sta in the guard station, if we wanted. <laughs> you eat, you die. <laughs> <laughs> Whew, she's alive. Very good. Very good. All right, let's uh, let's chat the old lady up. All right, let's do it. She's very talkative. So let's see if we can get out of her. <laughs> uh, I was wondering about D Vasquez, the producer. Oh, the studio bigwigs love her. So she always gets her way. She seems bitter. Do you not like the producer? She did it. <laughs> <laughs> Look, the studio people don't want me talking about her, so sorry. <laughs> Joe in the chat says, Pridge, do you advise that they implement an initial speed trial system in the U.S.? <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's a strong no <laughs> i don't see how there could be any problems to trying to speed up the uh the process of of you know trying people <laughs> Listen, like our court no. systems our court systems overburden but i very much promise you the way to fix that is not a complete compromise of justice <laughs> no if you want if you want speedier trials you just hire defense attorney sonic t hedgehog <laughs> perfect can I ask you about Sal Manella, the director? Sal? He's soft. A pushover. Does whatever Vasquez tells him to. She treats him like dirt, but I think he likes it. Ooh. <laughs> huh? Why would anyone like being treated like dirt? That doesn't make any sense, does it, Nick? Uh, no. No, it doesn't, Maya. Nick is a <laughs> fetish. Secretly a masochist. Yeah. I'll, I'll tell you when you're older, Maya. <laughs> <laughs> about Mr. Hammer. Uh, I heard about what you said today, cheeky whippersnapper. Poor old Hammer. You drag his star down from the sky and stomp on it. Calling him a criminal, a thief. I, 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 
I won't forget this! Uh-oh. She's really pissed this time. Real, yeah, okay. real talk, real talk. When y'all were growing up, was pissed a bad word? Yeah. Yes. It's it's the most bizarre thing. For some reason, my family didn't care about me saying the word pissed as a kid. And so I said it around like my friends' families and they were like, what did you just say? And I was like, well, I'm pissed. <laughs> I, got, I got yelled at for that. So. It was like the cuss word version of being ticked off. Exactly. Yeah. But I don't know why. Uh -huh. I don't know why my family, for some reason, didn't think it was a thing when everybody else, it was definitely a thing. It was just a big, it was a big prank. They were like, hey, <laughs> yeah. let's pretend like piss isn't a bad word. And then when he goes over to his friends' houses, they're going to get all pissed at him. <laughs> and then and then I did it and they were like, hey, look, look over there. It's Ashton Kutcher. You're on Candid Camera. <laughs> Welcome back to Candid Camera. <laughs> you listen to me, whippersnapper. My poor old hammer would never do such a thing. Why would he steal Powers' costume so he could sneak by me? He would never stoop so low. It's impossible. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you for all that very unimportant information. Oh, yeah, it was not really useful. Uh, Pun Punchin says, I used to think the word bastard meant homeless person for some reason. So I was walking with my mom and saw a homeless person and pointed them out and said, look <laughs> at that bastard. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that is... <laughs> From the mouths of babes, you know? <laughs> look at that bastard. <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> oh. And then your mom was like, yes, honey, it is. <laughs> That's very funny. All right, uh, where should we go from here? <laughs> Dang, I don't know why everyone was calling Jon Snow a homeless person. <laughs> uh, let's check the employee area first. All righty. Nope, all right. I guess they're not filming today either. Yeah, no, they're not gonna film two day, three <laughs> days after someone just died. He's also <sighs> the main antagonist of the show. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on, what are they even doing here? Yeah, we were we recast the villain in three days. <laughs> <laughs> I did want to see them filming, just one time. This trial will be over and done to by tomorrow. You can you, you can come see them film later. I guess. This is where you found that bottle of sleeping pills, right? Uh-huh. I wonder if there are any other clues lying around. Yeah! No, no, no. No touching. Yeah. Oh, sorry, pal. Why did they do that fade to black there? That was like a very odd transition. I thought he like not, did he not Phoenix on yeah, it, was, <laughs> it was very confusing. <laughs> sorry, I didn't mean to knock you unconscious, pal. <laughs> Just the police officer here. Uh, I've been practicing my taijutsu. <laughs> it didn't mean to frighten you. Didn't mean, I almost had a heart attack. <laughs> I guess I can be a little dr dramatic at times. It's a big word I for gumshoe. That I word means it's the actor in me. <laughs> dramatic indeed. Yeah, you know, I took four years of acting college. <laughs> and then for some reason, I became a detective. <laughs> hey, I mean. <clears throat> they should just hire gumshoe to be the new evil magistrate. <laughs> Probably has the build for very it. very good. Yeah. He's, he's got perfect. yeah. He's got the build, and he's clearly an actor, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> he's got that drama too. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, I'm here to examine the plate on that table. I'm here to examine the food on that plate too. <laughs> oh yeah, this is this is good evidence right here. Uh, Gumshoe, that is that is three day old meat. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are you looking for sleeping pills? Yeah, pal. Traces thereof. That's another big word for gumshoe. Yeah, it's, next he's gonna be start <laughs> saying. He's gonna be saying ergo. <laughs> <laughs> he's just learning from Edgeworth. It's just really rubbing off on him. <laughs> Three-day-old meat that has been allegedly spiked with sleeping pills. 
Clearly you haven't seen this updated steak. <laughs> so you're looking for traces of the sleeping pills. How? Well, I'm going to eat all the food, and if I fall asleep afterwards, <laughs> I'll know there were sleeping pills in it. It's a very scientific. It's <laughs> For a thorough examination, I gotta take the plate back to the precinct. But I have the capabilities to make a cursory examination right here. A science guy gave me some testing solutions. Is that just the same picture of the look, sleeping pills? That looks suspiciously like the bottle of sleeping pills. <laughs> this reacts to sleeping pills, see? Because it is sleeping pills. <laughs> Turns out, there's yeah. sleeping pills here. <laughs> If there are traces, it'll change color. <laughs> wow, neat. Well, Detective Gumshoe, what are you waiting for? The stakes will turn gray, kind of like they do if they're three days old. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, everything in due time, pal. Well, the testing solution on the plate changed color, all right. So there were sleeping pills on the plate. Just like it. All right. The hey, steak. we finally got like the steak idea. plate. I like the idea that someone just threw sleeping pills out of plates and Will Powers <laughs> just didn't care. Just like, he ate so fast he didn't notice they were whole, like, like kind of like hiding a dog's pill and cheese. Yeah. <laughs> he, just, like, he just like gave it to Will Powers and he just didn't give a shit. He just was licking the steak. Like, <laughs> <laughs> How go was your... <laughs> What a weird way to ask this question. How goes your you? investigation? <laughs> to tell the truth, it's a real mess, pal. Some people think we should pursue the case we already have against Powers. Despite the fact that we have no evidence. <laughs> and some people think we should switch suspects. What do you think, Detective Gumshoe? Don't. Think? What's that mean? <laughs> Well, pal, I hate to admit it, but I'm not sure I buy the case against Mr. Powers anymore. I feel kind of bad for Mr. Edgeworth, though. I'm gonna beat his ass again tomorrow, though, so tough shit. Just you wait for him to bring that updated autopsy report. <laughs> this man's been dead for three days and suddenly it's different tomorrow. Uh... He was actually <laughs> killed by the thinker. <laughs> <laughs> it kills again. It's a cursed <laughs> object. How is Edgeworth doing anyway? Why you want to know? Oh, no reason. <laughs> did, he, did, he, did he say anything about me? Or? <laughs> it's not like I like him or anything, Baka. <laughs> <laughs> just saying Baka like that. <laughs> Baka. <laughs> oh, I don't like me. Edgeworth is out of control. He was in the waiting room and he crushed this paper cup with hot, hot coffee in it. He's got third degree burns. Talk about burns, pal. Wow, the fury of Edgeworth. Yeah, crushing paper cups. And I'll crush you like a paper cup. <laughs> uh, we've got a lot, of, a lot of praise in the chat for when we randomly stay in character for commentary. Uh... <laughs> And uh, Punchin says, really stupid question, law question. I'm laughing so freaking hard right now. If I die from laughing too hard, is this stream held accountable? <laughs> uh, no. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Say, whatever happened with that empty bottle? Oh, the bottle of sleeping pills? Well, I got some good news for you about that. They found the victim, Jack Hammer's prints on the bottle. So that means... Yep, sounds like the one who put Powers to sleep was none other than Gengar. <laughs> I, I mean, the victim. Fucking good, good pull on that one. So I was right. A Pokemon was involved. I, I, I want to double, I want to double, triple emphasize that, like, we can actually just go home now. <laughs> there is literally no possible way you can find Will Powers guilty anymore. So, like, we're done. Yeah. Yeah, there is so much, there is 
unbelievable doubt that Will Powers could possibly be. E even the police officer is like, yeah, I don't think he did it. Um... Yeah, it, 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 <laughs> but Edgeworth's just like, no, he did it. <laughs> Shut up. Coffee. Coffee. Very good. <laughs> Empty dressing rooms like this are kind of lonely, aren't they? I'm sure Mr. Powers will be back soon. He'll be fine. Is he still, like, I'm assuming, I guess he's, he's still being held. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. I mean, they could at least, like, let him off with bail or something. <laughs> he's got that iCarly money. <laughs> nope, you went to the dressing room again. I'm again. so bad at that. <laughs> <laughs> See, folks, this is the stuff, if you watch the YouTube version, that I cut out. I almost did it a third time, too. Not a whole lot here. I did it again, son of a goddamn... <laughs> <laughs> Why do they put the... I... Okay, actually, that makes sense. Hours. Yeah, I think we have to go there. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing this on purpose. I swear to God, I'm just like, okay, yeah, this is the way to go. I, don't, I assume if we examine things, it's not gonna. Motherfucker. <laughs> I swear, can a ghost you know? be accused of a crime? I assume I fucking did it again. <laughs> I don't know why. I Man, always it's assume. It's the top option. I always Just assume. Go with the top option. I always assume it's the bottom option. Well, stop. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> we don't need any more of her condescending stare. <laughs> Think back, Nick, to the day of the murder. Mr. Hammer put on the Steel Samurai costume. Then he left from here to go to Studio 2? Right. But why? I wonder if someone called him, like the director or the producer? Dun, dun, dun. Oh, God, I hope Salmonella did it. <laughs> hey, <clears throat> <laughs> Maya, are you okay? <laughs> yeah, sorry. Bug threw him, flew in my throat. <laughs> hey, Nick, it's Miss Vasquez. Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> H E L L O! What does that get? M Maya, you should at least try to be polite. I mean, she is kind of being an asshole. What did that spell? <laughs> I'm not so good at spelling. <laughs> I'm watching the clouds. That's all she had to say, apparently. <laughs> Look, that one looks like a choo choo train. <laughs> What do you see in the clouds? <laughs> do you like my Gandalf pipe? <laughs> um, excuse me. Mr. Hammer came here on the day of the murder and... Shh! The clouds. Um, don't shush me. <laughs> Perhaps you didn't hear me. I'm watching the clouds. <laughs> Someone in the chat says, I see Mr. Monkey in the clouds. <laughs> Mr. Monkey. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I'm not interested in talking to you. Do something, Nick. She's really ticking me off. Oh, dear. <laughs> <sighs> um... Mr. Powers wasn't the killer. You don't have to cancel the Steel Samurai. But you do have to cancel Salmonella. <laughs> I think I'm tired of the Steel Samurai. You, you did it. Nick, she did it. She's the killer. My fey blood speaks to me. I know it. I know it. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> I like how oh. Phoenix isn't saying anything in this. Yeah, he's, he's, he's just let, he's just letting his seventeen-year-old assistant interrogate witnesses. 
Um, I was wondering if you could tell me about Mr. Manila. Not that I really want to know. If you must talk about that man, perhaps you could talk about it in the trailer. <laughs> By yourselves. Oh. Oh, dear. <laughs> okay, well. Oh, that, that, was dear. that was enlightening as fuck. I mean, we can <laughs> present something if we I'm like, I don't know. Just let me, I just want to see if she says anything. She's not even looking. Okay. Okay. Hey, you, look. Showing that to me, Nick. <laughs> it's like, well, this, this person won't talk to me. So, Maya, what do you think about this evidence we got five minutes ago? <laughs> Assistant cleaning up yesterday? Funny, it still seems pretty messy in here. I guess she was still on a high from getting that rare card she needed. Oh, yeah, new card smell. <laughs> All right, well. D. Vasquez. Oh. I, st <laughs> I stand D. Vasquez. Uh, actually, I can't remember how this. I, I, would... I can't remember. Honestly, go ahead. How this case goes. I, I think she did it. I don't know who actually did it, but. <laughs> she, uh, she's She's kind of like. The goth version of Lady Demetrescu. <laughs> she's she's. I think, goth, I think Lady Demetrescu is the goth version of Lady yeah. Demetrescu. She's she's Demetrescu? she's like the vaguely she's, she's... Eastern European version of <laughs> Lady Demetrescu. Yeah, Demetrescu, I think it is. Yeah, Demetrescu. Uh, I and she's she's unfortunately probably not nine foot six, but tragic. I know. I'd still let her step on me. Absolutely. Are you kidding me? Uh, let's go I mean, talk to him. Apparently Salmonella lets her step on him. <laughs> yeah. He very much did. Uh, uh, if you actually look up either D. Vasquez or Salmonella, I think the picture is D like reading a script and sitting on Sal while he's on all fours. That's incredible. God. That's incredible. <laughs> Fundren says, I don't know if she killed Hammer, but I'd sure let her choke me to death. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. All right. Mr. Wright, you did very well again today. Thank you. Oh, thanks. Um, could you not look like you're about to burst into tears? It's weird that they made him say that then, because they have a sprite where Will Powers looks like he's actually going like, to burst into tears. <laughs> he's not doing uh -huh. it. Wow, Nick. You must have really wowed him in there. You could stop looking so vulnerable, too. Hey, WP. Only one day left until you maybe die. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make it count. Yes. Though there's not really anything I can do to help. <laughs> You're right. You're useless. <laughs> I'm not really sure what I can do either. Yeah, what can I'm you do? I'm not sure why I'm here. <laughs> Please, this is no laughing matter. This man could go to prison. For murder, even though technically he shouldn't at all be a, still a suspect. Are <laughs> there any talk options for him? I'm sure there has to be. Okay, what do you think about Vasquez? Will she can can she step on you as well? Oh, I'd love it if she stepped on me. <laughs> oh, the producer. She's well respected in the industry. They say she's a genius. Genius. Yeah, she's got great jeans. <laughs> Levi's, she's I been think. <laughs> she's been at Global Studios for five years now. Right or wrong, nobody dares tell her different these days. Why is that? Ever since she came on board, we've had nothing but hits. Global Studios was on its knees, but she picked it up and made it shine. And then she put all of us on our knees. <laughs> oh, and and what? Nothing. Forget it. It's not like I let her step on me and choke me. <laughs> I've only heard rumors, anyhow. We're really running this joke. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell me anything about Mr. Manella? Oh, he used to be a minor straight-to-video director. That sounds like a porn thing. 
<laughs> but something in his work caught Vasquez's eye. It was a porn thing. <laughs> she brought the steel samurai to him. Idea to him. Now everyone knows the name Sal Manila. Because of all the sex offender registries he's on. <laughs> <laughs> I hear he's pretty much at her beck at her uh, I hear he's pretty much at her beck and call though. I love the musical artist Bick. <laughs> Bick. <laughs> Whenever she says jump, he asks how high and all that. I can imagine him being at her beck and call and something else. But I can't imagine I can't imagine him jumping. God damn it. Yeah. White boy can't jump. <laughs> <clears throat> I was wondering about Mr. Hammer. He was a big star back in the day, right? But then he just dropped off the face of the earth. Oh. Yes, you're right. In fact, he was my role model when I started in the business. But he just stopped taking on big roles right after he made that Twitter post about QAnon. <laughs> Somebody losing in the chat said, yeah, he got cancelled, literally right as you were saying that. <laughs> got him. <laughs> That's when he began appearing in the little productions at Global. <laughs> How could he do that? I was really looking forward to a sequel to Samurai Summer. Still <laughs> Samurai? He just gave up being a star five years ago. Actually, now that I think about it, it was right when Miss Vasquez came to Global. Five years ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the chat. Fundren said penis got cancelled and immediately followed up with Phoenix. I meant to type Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> Just to clarify, this is the same person who said that they thought bastard meant homeless person, so... <laughs> Oh, that is unfortunate. Uh, let's present the suspicious yeah. evidence. Excuse me. Thank you, thank you for showing me whatever that is. I wish I could think of some way for me to help you. Sorry. This was the sleeping pills that you inadvertently ate. Okay, he doesn't have any idea. I don't know what the fuck that is. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, hello. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? That's better. <laughs> oh, I was just cleaning up the dressing room. I guess WP won't be using it anymore since he's gonna die, so... What? What? Why? But WP's innocent! Yes, and I'm the Queen of England. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and I'm really grateful for all you've done. But this week is the last episode of the Steel Samurai. What? No! <laughs> oh! Dun dun dun! I was wondering if I could ask you about Mr. Hammer. Yes. On the day of the murder, he went to Studio Two. Huh? I thought he went to Studio One. He stole the Steel Samurai costume, too! What? Why would Mr. Hammer do something like that? Oh. I guess the rumor must be true, then. You know, about the incident. <laughs> the rumor? Yeah, that rumor. Yeah, this Vasquez, that producer, had some kind of hold on Hammer. <laughs> She, she was stepping on him. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, why are you making it a sexual thing? You're gross. <laughs> she had some dirt on him. He'd do anything she said, apparently. Some dirt? What dirt? Dirt. <laughs> some igneous rock. Maybe a little bit of metamorphic. <laughs> Oh, fuck, that's funny. What kind of dirt? You know, dirt. <laughs> you know, bad stuff. 
Um, I know what dirt means. About five years ago, they were filming a movie starring Mr. Hammer. They were using the new studio, Studio 2. Some sort of accident happened during filming. After that, Never used Studio 2 again. They left the film set the way it was, too. <laughs> the film set? Was that... Was that trailer part of the film set, then? The trailer that I've been caught in ten separate times? What do you... Or, uh, that's a different person. <laughs> what, what do you mean, the last Steel Samurai? I know it's a shock. But nothing could be done to save it now. Whoever really did kill Mr. Hammer also signed the Steel Samurai's death warrant. No. No! Also, I hear that Global Studios is going to change its programming. They're not going to make kids shows anymore. What? Why? Because Salmonella is directing a bunch of porn here now. <laughs> I don't know. It's sad. That's what Global Studios decided. <clears throat> Why aren't they going to make kid shows anymore? Real big wigs don't want the Steel Samurai around anymore. They want to forget all this ever happened. They want it quiet. You understand? <laughs> How can they just do that? What about all the kids who love the Steel Samurai? Like Cody Hackens. <laughs> it's okay. I'm sure the kids will get over it. <laughs> They'll find a new hero to follow. No, that can't be true. If the program just ends, they'll be heartbroken for sure. Nick, say something. I, I'm a lawyer. I can't tell them to, to change their programming. Um, yeah. I also don't give a shit. <laughs> yeah. This sounds like a you problem, Maya. <laughs> I think evidence rather than words is called for here. Here, take a look at this. I'm slightly confused. What am I trying to show her? The kids oh, no. love the Steel Samurai. Oh. Is it the Path to Glory book, then? And this is... A fan collected all of these photographs. The kids love the Steel Samurai. The show shouldn't oh, be wow. canceled just so One some adults can kid save made face. a bunch of photos. <laughs> <laughs> I think you would understand that you should keep this show running just for Cody Hackens. I don't care the thousands of dollars you have to pay these actors. Um, and he has cancer. Oh, <laughs> so sad. It's the Kids Miracle Wish Foundation keeping the Steel Samurai alive. Miracle Wish? Is that, wait, is that what it's called? Make-A-Wish? Is it make -a <laughs> I think you mix Miracle that's, Wish. That's the, that's the Ace Attorney wish. universe version of it. You know, it's legally distinct. <laughs> You're right. Okay. Well, what could I do? <laughs> Good point. She is well, literally an assistant. Uh, you are just a PA. I did forget about that. Uh, there is really nothing you can do. You can tell me something. Tell me what it is that Global Studios is so intent on hiding. Tell me about this incident five years ago. Okay. Did you tell us what happened five years ago? I know I just asked you, but because of the way the game is set up, I have to create a new dialogue option to, br to bring this up for no reason. Well, that was a weird way of putting it, but I can't <laughs> tell you what I heard. Apparently, five years ago, someone died, and it was Hammers' fault. Someone died? It was an accident, of course. Anyway... The producer, Miss Vasquez, managed to hush it up. And that's the dirt she had on Mr. Hammer? That's why Mr. Hammer would do anything Miss Vasquez asked him to do? Among other reasons. <laughs> but it was an accident, right? Why didn't they just make it public? Well, you know Mr. Hammer was a big star back then. 
They were afraid about what would happen to his career if word got out. He might get cancelled. <laughs> <laughs> for, for killing a man. But now he's been cancelled from life. <laughs> I know who did it. The ghost of the guy he killed. Killed, killed Jack Ooh. Hammer. Okay, Maya. Solved this case. Maya, I need you to, to pull this person into your body and ask them. If they did it. And then we'll send you to jail for life. <laughs> <laughs> I see. You know who's more you know who knows more about this? Miss Oldbag. She was here at the studios back then, you know. Thanks. We'll try asking her. If she'll talk. Good luck. <laughs> Dressing. <laughs> what, you're still slinking around? If you like the place so much, why don't you take over for me? Phoenix Wright, security guard. <laughs> oh man, that's the next game. All the Phoenix Wright fans, hands up if you want the Phoenix Wright security guard sequel. It's just With a, a tie into you know, the Paul Blart Mall Cop universe. <laughs> that's just, that's just <laughs> gumshoe. That's just straight up gumshoe. With a segue. <laughs> The old windbag doesn't look so good. Everybody's doing their darndest to forget Hammer. Who do they think made Global Studios what it is today? Hammer! It's all due to Hammer! She's starting to froth at the mouth, Nick. She has rabies. Maybe we should keep a safe distance. <laughs> <laughs> it was the donuts! <clears throat> uh, Narwax in the chat just gave us a subscription. Thank you so much, Narwax. I think we're actually... Uh, that should put us at 15, which factually, if we get to 25, we get another emote slot. Uh, that's not... Just to clarify, not a pressure to people in the chat. Um, uh, I wanted to ask you about five years ago. <laughs> Who told? Who did you hear that from? I, uh... Huh? Nichols. N Nichols. Nichols, Nick. Penny Nichols. That assistant we talked to. I don't think I. Here's put her picture in case you forgot. I don't think I put together that her name was Penny Nichols, which is very good. Penny Nichols. Yeah. yeah. She's worth six whole cents. Uh, oh right. Anyway, we heard about the accident. It was during filming with Jack Hammer. He killed a man, didn't he? That's a very blunt way of putting that piece. Nice. <laughs> oh, whippersnappers! Judging up dirt on someone's past like that, and the recently departed, no less. I suppose you think this is fun? A little. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just doing my job to protect <laughs> Mr. Powers. What do you think, this is some kind of video game? And you claim that Hammer stole Powers' costume. You expect me to believe that rubbish? Or do you have some kind of proof? Proof that Hammer stole Powers' costume? Hmm. I mean... We've got the sleeping uh, pills. The yeah. yeah. I can prove that Mr. Hammer stole Mr. Powers' costume. Here's my proof. What? What's a little empty bottle supposed to prove? It's a bottle of sleeping pills with Mr. Hammer's fingerprints on it. What does that prove? I I I'm sure old Hammer had some sleepless nights. Where's your proof that he used those pills on Powers? Okay, it's see. this spear. We got, we got it. <laughs> 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 Mr. Powers did it. <laughs> Mr. Powers ate a T-bone steak for lunch, correct? Well, yes. So? This is the plate that he used to eat that steak. There are traces Carry of... Carry around with me. <laughs> there are traces of sleeping pill powder on the plate. Flies hovering all around Phoenix now. <laughs> I see. Poor, poor Hammer. 
You did wrong, Hammer. Rest your soul. She kind of did accept that pretty quickly. I'm a little surprised. Miss Oldbag? Okay. You win. I'll talk. I'm tired, see? Tired of holding it all in. Now I ah. legit feel bad. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Miss Oldbag. You're right. Five years ago, there was an accident. A fatal accident. What's worse, a paparazzi took a photo of it. That photo, well, it caused quite a stir. Uh, Uber in the chat's going to bed. Thank you, Uber. Appreciate it. Guess who made it all better? Vasquez. She has ties to the Mafia. Uh-huh. Good for her. <laughs> she silenced that paparazzi. With a... Okay, that paparazzi dude's definitely dead, right? Yeah, that's a... <laughs> now he's sleeping with the fishes. I was going to say, you don't, tell, you don't say someone has ties to the Mafia and say they silenced someone without the implication that Vasquez had a member of the paparazzi murdered. That's a choice of words on that one. <laughs> <laughs> that was the beginning. <laughs> Lizard says, now his kneecaps are more like frisbees. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Vasquez went all Tanya Harding on his ass. <laughs> After that, she became a force to be reckoned with here at the studio. See. But you have to understand... Poor old Hammer never meant harm, any harm to anyone. Miss Oldbag. Hold on a minute. Poor Miss Oldbag. Poor Jack Hammer. Here, take this. Hmm? A photograph? <laughs> Look at this photograph. <laughs> we already did that. <laughs> yeah, I was, uh, <laughs> couldn't resist. Wait a second. This... No. That's my line? <laughs> <laughs> this is the picture. Is this the trailer in Studio 2? Hammer was supposed to fight with a bad guy on the top of those stairs there. He pushed the other actor, and the man fell onto the flower box fence. But how did you get this? It was a long time ago. I don't feel much like talking about it. I understand. <laughs> yeah. says, I was that paparazzi. <laughs> <laughs> now, Fridge, uh, is that an admissible excuse in court for how you got evidence? Mm. Well, I got someone, but they don't want to talk about it. I mean, they have to have some anonymous witnesses for, like, witness protection stuff, right? Well, yeah, yeah. I mean, for evidence like that, someone has to authenticate it. Mm. And photos... Photos can be self-authenticating evidence. Mm. God, you guys have caught me four years removed from my 2L evidence class. Damn it. <laughs> I'd be able to give Welcome so much. I'd be able to give. I'd be able to give such a better primer on authenticating evidence if it wasn't, you know, multiple years ago. Mm. <laughs> I mean, theoretically, if I mean, you could get D Vasquez to admit that photo is real. Mm. I don't think she would, but gotcha. she could authenticate it. It's gonna be well. Maybe we should go talk to her about it. It's you can tell yourself. All right, all right, Vasquez. What do you have to say about this? Nothing. <laughs> She's not even looking. Where? What? Where did you get that? I, well, now that I think about it, I probably shouldn't have showed this to the person who has ties to the Mafia. <laughs> old time. Phoenix Wright gets his knees broken. <laughs> uh, old? She means the security lady, Miss Oldbag, Nick. Right. Uh, anyway, Miss Vasquez, 
You hid this incident from the press, didn't you? And you used it to control Mr. Hammer. The wind. <laughs> the... huh? It's gotten stronger, don't you think? The wind? Your conversation interests me. Let's talk about it more inside the trailer. <laughs> Nick, she went inside the trailer. Well, we're going to walk well, in here. I guess I'll go back outside Studio One. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> Sound of several handguns cocking from inside yeah, the trailer. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> she's like, come with me into this room. And she's like, okay, I've just got the uh, prop spear ready to go. And... <laughs> All right, we're ready to stage a murder. <laughs> hmm. You came. Well then, what was that about what you were talking about? <laughs> what was that you were talking about? That's what it is. Why is she so eager to talk all of a sudden? Miss... She tried to bury five years ago. Yeah, she's going to be a bit more talkative now. Yeah, you, I'm, I, it's, I'm almost essentially blackmailing her at this point. Like, just a, a step shy of it. No, this is legal blackmail. Yeah. <laughs> this is called this is called evidence, mm -hmm. which is legal blackmail. <laughs> yeah, the chest. Finally, it's time for Zach to shine when he can actually go into the trailer. <laughs> Damn, they got me. Uh, look at the plays. Look at the moves. <laughs> I'm a pro gamer now, Miss <laughs> Vasquez. You were using that accident. You were blackmailing Mr. Hammer so you could control him, weren't you? Okay, what is Jack Hammer holding in that picture? It looks like a tennis racket. It does look like a tennis racket. I think it's a samurai tennis movie. <laughs> Watch it. You know, uh, that's why he, that's why he was doing. Step, step back. That's... Go ahead. Take it. Again. Take it one more time. You got this. That's Just why breathe. he was. God damn it, Wes. <laughs> <laughs> that's why he was doing kid shows for Petty Change. So I'm a blackmailer now. Well, that's what it was, wasn't it? I mean, sure, it was an accident. But you used it to drag Mr. Hammer down from his rightful place as a star. Oh? I haven't pulled anyone down from anywhere. Mr. Hammer's career went sour of its own accord. B but... You were the cause! You pressured him and to think it was just an accident. Excuse me. What is this all about? You keep saying accident, accident. How are you so sure? Ooh. What do you right of her? What do you mean? Must I spell everything out for you? Think. What would it be if it wasn't an accident? Lizard in the an chat says, incident. Lizard in the chat says, crinkle me up. <laughs> <laughs> no. No way. You mean Mr. Hammer did it on purpose? That is what I mean. Oh shit, that face. Where's your proof? Can you prove it? Hmm. Just think. Would he have let me run his life for five years over a mere accident? And I ran him hard, believe you me. God damn. Ooh, okay. All right, girl. <laughs> but the security lady said it was an accident. Oh, well, she was a big fan of hammers, you see. She jumped on the reporter who brought that photo into the studio. She wrenched it out of his hands, she did. Gave him a few bruises, too. So that's why she had the photo. She's an old fool. Of course, all the reporter would need is the negatives. He could have made a copy. But he didn't. The only copy of that photo is the one you hold. Give it to me. Now. What? This is valuable evidence, boys! Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh god, we are getting murdered by the mob. Hey, what's going on? You need some? Yeah, what do you need? Come on! I do appreciate that they very much are, like, 
stereotypical Yakuza characters. <laughs> but oh, yeah. yeah. This one, like just over her shoulder with the, the red tie, that's a pretty wild smile. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey, what's up? They call me Wild Smile. <laughs> Chrono Wizard in the chat says, nobody expects the Italian Inquisition. <laughs> 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 that's really good. Hey, you want us to think of outside and make us some stromboli? <laughs> Give me the gabagoo. <laughs> I'm assuming that the rest of this game series takes place as, with Phoenix as a ghost, because it's about to get, get shot to hell right now. Um, I mean, the one guy on the right is le just reaching for a gun right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, who are they? <laughs> Phoenix, it's your birthday, and we're here to celebrate for a surprise party. <laughs> Oh boy, my birthday! No, that, that, that's Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> Professionals. They're good at erasing various things. <laughs> like photo Narwax Narwax says, no, 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 he's pulling out this, his Steel Samurai trading cards. <laughs> <laughs> Trade with me! <laughs> what do you think? Would you like to be erased? I mean, anything for you. What? The trial ends tomorrow? How unfortunate. It's a shame you'll have to miss it. Uh, tell me why. Why do you want this photograph so badly? This is Mr. Hammer's dirt, no? Why should D. Vasquez care at all? I'm sure you'll have plenty of time to think about that where you're going. So long, friend. Boys, erase away. No! <laughs> oh, Maya. Oh, shit. Hold it right there. Shit, uh, the fucking hero. Gumshoe right, actually right, doing now? something good. Fuck <laughs> yes. All right, 1v4. Can Gumshoe <laughs> take down four train mafia members? <laughs> Pretty. Point. <laughs> Sorry, I talked over it when you said it before. You want to give me this one more time? I heard everything, pal. D. Vasquez. You're coming down to the precinct with me now. Oh, hey, what's up? It's all my cousins. <laughs> oh, hey, go. Oh, I it. Hey, it's, it's Dicky Gum. What's going on, boy? Not bad. Again, I still think that they would just be like, well, it's one police officer. Let's kill him. <laughs> All of these guys have killed a police officer before. I guarantee be it. About that. I guarantee it. Very well. It appears this contest will be decided tomorrow then. In court. I'll be looking forward to it. Oh, Boss, we, we could just kill we could just kill that cop too. <laughs> we we don't mind. <laughs> no no. Hey hey! You okay, pal? Sorry, I was a little late with my entrance. I was pausing for dramatic effect. <laughs> dramatique. Uh, you know I got that dramatique in me. Dramatique. <laughs> I don't get many chances to practice that sort of thing. Detective Gumshoe? Thank you, thank you, thank you! I was really scared. Huh? Uh, don't mention it, pal. Just doing my job. Detective Gumshoe? Sorry, it's just... I've wanted to say that line ever since I became a detective. That's brilliant. That's really good. God damn it, man. This this, this case is making me actually think positive things about Gumshoe. I know. <laughs> I never I never thought it'd happen. I mean, we're gonna have to stop calling okay. him Gumfuck after this. I know, right? <laughs> he, he, gets his, he gets his name back. Mm. Just wait. He'll, he'll go back to being Gumfuck again very shortly. Mm-hmm. Okay, I've got one more job to do today. <laughs> Narwax says Gum Gumshoe is a himbo, and that is a hundred percent true. <laughs> accurate. <laughs> Completely accurate. I'm sure we'll run into. Uh, I'm sure we'll run into each other again soon. Yeah, probably tomorrow morning <laughs> at the court. <laughs> well, Nick, it looks like we're getting close to the bottom of this. All right, boys, now that the cop's gone, let's go murder these guys again. Yeah. <laughs> Just have people like trailing us for the rest of the day.
I know. <laughs> and who's at the bottom? I feel like, again, there's so many D Vasquez, like, BDSM jokes to make here. D Vasquez! So little, so little we time. We the bottom, and now we're here. <laughs> Phoenix is the bottom, yes. Well, that was actually way shorter than I thought it was going to be. Uh, yeah, this one, this these last two are pretty short, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I mean, we 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 blew through that, and we spent so much time reacting to our incredibly active chat. Thank you all so much, and we we got twenty nine viewers right now. Wes, before we get started, would you like to tell people about your podcast? Because I realize oh, we've I never promoted that on this show, and people like you and your voice acting, and this show I think would very much tie into their interests. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so for anybody watching, uh, a couple of my good friends, not including Zach or Pridge, because they're not my good friends. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, <laughs> no, but uh, they're they're friends that I live with. Uh, they're in the same apartment building as me, and we went to college together. We started a podcast uh, called Stranger Than Fan Fiction. Uh, we're all professional actors, just like Zach. Uh, we got together and really wanted to practice voiceover stuff. Uh, and the, the way that I kind of came up to do that was to read fan fiction that we find on the internet. That's really good and not make fun of it. It's not a, it's not a, we're finding shitty fan fiction and like ripping it apart. It's like, we find stuff that's written really well and then give it kind of like an audiobook treatment amongst the four of us kind of re giving it dramatic readings. Uh, and we find some really good shit. If you want to check it out, it's it's a lot of like goofy silliness. We all kind of read fan fiction, and then kind of talk about it and dick around for like an hour at a time. Do you do you have a good uh, uh, good link for them to talk to to find this? Yeah, uh, our website. If you want to check that out, which has a link to I think all of the episodes, they're on like Spotify, Apple Podcast, wherever. Uh, it's stffpodcast.com I think stffpodcast.com yeah that is going to do it for this episode of Ace Attorney with an actual lawyer once again thank you so much for watching we will come back next week to finally take D Vasquez down hopefully uh, but until next time please tune into our Twitch channel which is twitch.tv slash save data team we record it live every Wednesday at 7.30pm Eastern time so if you want to catch it live there we have a very fun and active chat please do so uh, but if not, we will post this every following Monday with a slightly edited version for your enjoyment. But until next time, everybody, I plead the fifth.